you know, just getting away from everything. Yeah, it's just beautiful out here. Got a little view. Yeah. Nice. That is one good thing about coming up when it's this time of year. Because uh, I'm assuming in the summer, this would, this would, with all the leaves, you probably wouldn't see it. But you can see the mountain in the distance. Like, obviously, there's still trees there. A little bit. Watch the rock there. <laughs> the sun feels so good. Yes, the sun's beautiful. It's throwing everything out. All right, we're continuing on this. So far, a very beautiful trail. You can see it started to freeze. You call this what, a vernal pool? Yes. We learned that on one of our many hikes, right? Yeah. All right. So we're back on another access road. I think what you'll notice, there are a lot of options for what kind of route you want to take and you can vary it up kind of in any way you want to. We've been trying to stay to the outside for the most part. The trails continuously cross the asset access roads. So really you could just take the access road if you want to walk it and do that. We're just trying to extend it a little bit and get to the outside and see what the trails offer and see if there's any views. Because obviously the access road stays in, inside a little more. Do whatever you feel comfortable with, vary it up. Plenty of different lengths you can do. And uh, yeah, hopefully that helps. Looks like we're coming up to another little road we might want to take. If you notice here, you see a little bit of this if you go on the access road. We didn't take that little turn off that I had seen up before. Uh, Ola let me know that it would have taken us way outside of the park area, at least the part of the park that we wanted to walk. And then some of it's more for like snowmobiling and things like that. Because those are the only motorized vehicles allowed here, I believe. So, yeah, we continued on the access road and that's partly what you'll find in some places depending on the time of year it may be just deep water right now it's deep water with the top frozen <laughs> you don't want to fall in and we're coming up to an ice skating rink it looks like let's <laughs> yeah okay so let's so i'll try to walk around the side of this chris is crunching on all the ice Not long enough, I'm getting, I think I got water in my shoe again. It sounds like glass breaking. It's like it's broken, right? That's, 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 yeah. decision if you want to go. This might be that return or it might not be on the map again or we have to go straight. I'm not sure. Let's check the map. Okay. So in the distance, you're not going to be able to see it. And on the other side of that little pond, we saw something just jumping down. It kind of looked like a squirrel, but from where we are, a squirrel would be this small. Yeah, it definitely this wasn't a squirrel. I don't know if, if it's what a weasel. I don't know if that's what a weasel looks like, but if it was I'm something sure. similar to that, because it was kind of skinny. It's like skinny, long. Slinky. Yeah. Long Very low to the ground and kind um, of long. So, we gotta, yeah. We gotta figure what it is. That's yeah, cool to see, though. Yeah. Well, that's why we go out in nature. You see cool things. That's true. That's right. true. Let's keep going. Well put. There's no way they can tell. You can't see you can't how see steep this is. But we said which way, you know, we had a choice to go left or right. And we said, let's just go left. And so we come to this, and it is so steep. I mean, this has to be. At least a 45 degree angle down. And it's just with all the leaves and stuff, it's so slippery. Oh, it's not gonna be fun. <laughs> Hey, 
Chris said that there's like a building up ahead. So let's go see. I know when I was looking up some pictures of the place here on Google, there was like an old chimney fireplace thing. So maybe that's what it is. We'll see. Hopefully something cool. I guess we found it. Come all the way back there, there was a whole building. No parking. Oh, you can see all the tire marks. Yeah, from back there, I, I thought it was a full building when we were far away. That looks cool. Oh, people are having parties here. Left a mess. <laughs> it's a cool fireplace. There's turkeys in the distance, you're not. I don't know if I can zoom that, in. They're, uh, yeah, they're behind that bridge now. They just ran behind it. I guess it's not Thanksgiving, so they feel it's safe to come out. Yeah, I'm, I'm curious. I'm going to keep rolling to see if we get closer and can see them because you guys probably won't believe us. It must have been how many? About six? Probably. Well, it worked. Yeah, it was no, a little, we'll... little snake in well, river stream thing. That's a couple of differences. Maybe. That goes under the oh, road. Oh, there was that little road thing there. It looks like they were going to down the road. Oh, so maybe we'll catch up to them. They're long gone by now. Oh. oh they're going up the hill. They're going up the hill. Can you see them? Oh, there's a lot of them. Holy man, but there's about... 20 maybe a little less but there's, there's definitely around 50 at least 15. God, they're going all the way up to the top can you believe we saw turkeys and like a weasel we think yeah that was crazy the turkeys were i didn't think there would be so many at once there was like 20. No. yeah i've only mostly seen like maybe six or so together that was nuts um but oh guys please don't forget while we're here to like subscribe hit the bell notification so you get notified and uh, share it with people please we're uh, trying to grow we appreciate the support Something caught my eye. So we put a big bird feeder up here. She decided she had to read a sign. We're at a different parking area from the one we were at. We just, I guess, walking past it on the trail. But yeah, dang. There's a sign there. There's nothing on here. Sign useless. <laughs>
All right, it's too noisy here. Here's where you encounter things. And you're like, what's the best decision? You try to make your best decision. I hope you can hear me over these cars. She's trying to go this way. That's a big leap. I don't know if I would. Oh, okay. Not bad. I was just gonna walk around this way. See around that little tree. And we'll catch you next. There's another one. It's so squishy. <laughs> Made it. I tried to use your way. It'll be interesting up there, we'll see. Alright. Uh, More mud. Got another stream we gotta cross. But we got more mud. This one moves. All right, not too bad. I just stepped it on the rocks that were under the water. It's not too deep. I don't want to get water in my shoes again. You did it! It's not, it, that wasn't so bad, thankfully, but like you can make mistakes and think it's like that. And the second you step in a little bit, the water goes up and over the side of your shoe <laughs> just from the, I guess, just from hitting it and goes up. That's not a good feeling, especially when it's ice cold water. I think what I love the most about going for the walks in the woods is you know the scenery and, and the quiet you know how quiet it is you know just getting away from everything yeah it's just beautiful out here they look like little trees growing pretty cool something caught my eye that was kind of random it must be one of them rare uh, type of fish it's one of them stream, stream fish, a foot trout. All right, guys, we're going to end the video here. We hope that you enjoyed following the trail along with us. Um, there's so many more trails to do in here. We kind of just oh, yeah. did the outside loop, right? Oh, yeah, you can, you have plenty of opportunity to customize your trail <laughs> walking. And if you don't feel like walking, you can do um, some biking here. So there's biking trails as well because, you know, it's a shared, shared trail use. Yeah. I don't know what else. What were your thoughts? Did you have fun? Yeah, it was fun. Yeah. I like looking at that chimney. Yes, that was cool. And then a couple of the brooks. I think those little things make the walk. Overall, it's just a nice walk outdoors. But those little things make it interesting. So, obviously, as always, always, we hope that you like, subscribe, hit the bell notification so you know when we post new videos. Leave a comment down below, and we'll see you in the next adventure. Did you say share it? That's your job. Don't forget to share it. <laughs> we'll see you in the next one.